Greetings to one and all watching this video. Mech Explanations welcomes you. Let us learn about the moment of inertia. The moment of inertia, otherwise known as the angular mass or rotational inertia, of a rigid body is a tensor that determines the torque needed for a desired angular acceleration about a rotational axis. It depends on the body's mass distribution and the axis chosen with larger moments requiring more to work to change the body's rotation. It is an extensive, additive, property, for a point mass the moment of inertia is just the mass times the square of perpendicular distance to the rotation axis. The moment of inertia of a rigid composite system is the sum of the moments of inertia of its component subsystems, all taken about the same axis. Moment of inertia plays the role in rotational kinetics that mass, inertia, plays in linear kinetics, both characterize the resistance of a body to changes in its motion. The moment of inertia depends on how mass is distributed around an axis of rotation, and will vary depending on the chosen axis. For an extended rigid body, the moment of inertia is just the sum of all the small pieces of mass multiplied by the square of their distances from the axis in question. For an extended body of a regular shape and uniform density, this summation sometimes produces a simple expression that depends on the dimensions, shape and total mass of the object. Moment of inertia also appears in momentum, kinetic energy and in Newton's laws of motion for a rigid body as a physical parameter that combines its shape and mass. There is an interesting difference in the way moment of inertia appears in planar and spatial movement. Planar movement has a single scalar that defines the moment of inertia, while for spatial movement the same calculations yield a 3 times 3 matrix of moments of inertia, called the inertia matrix or inertia tensor. Thank you and please support this YouTube channel. Mech Explanations with your valuable subscribings.